she's just a really compassionate person. And I think that's what this state needs, especially at this time. There's absolutely no question that, that uh, Becky Skillman loves the state. She wants to make the state an even better place to live in um, on a daily basis. Becky Skillman has brought dynamic leadership to the state of Indiana and that we need four more years of her leadership. She has earned her stripes. She has had many, many successes. She is very much a credit and an asset to the state. When Mitch Daniels tapped Becky on the shoulder in 2004 to be a running mate, he showed his confidence in her. And Becky has absolutely earned the respect. Becky Skillman is perfectly suited to the need arise to step into the office of governor. She is known and trusted and respected and liked on both sides of the political aisle and statewide. As Lieutenant Governor, her primary responsibility is to help pass the agenda of this administration. Uh, and this uh, administration has one of the most aggressive agendas in the history of the government of the state of Indiana. Because Becky Skillman has had that experience working with people on both sides of the aisle, in both the House and the Senate, she's been able to pass legislation that people didn't think was possible. It's mutually beneficial. We take great pride in the fact that the Daniel Skillman administration took a situation where we were almost a billion dollars in the red in the state of Indiana and balanced that budget in a very, very short period of time. Two back-to-back -back balanced budgets for Indiana is a phenomenal thing when you inherit the situation that they inherited. Up on us, but um, we've spent a great deal of our time focused on one chief initiative, and that is a complete economic comeback for the state of Indiana. During her time as Lieutenant Governor, Becky Skillman has focused a significant amount of attention on economic development. I've been an economic development professional for a little over 18 years. And in that time, without hesitation, Becky Skillman in the last four years has done more for rural economic development than anyone at the state has during my experience. Because she understands that those businesses are part of the engine which drives the state's economic development. We have this initiative where we work in regions to get the local economic development professionals, the elected officials, farmers, to come together and think of ways to include agriculture in their local economic development plans. The main thing Becky has done for agriculture is really bring it to the table. Agriculture is changing dramatically in the United States and Indiana, because of Becky, and I think the work that, that she's done and continues to do, uh, we're at the forefront of that. It takes all of us spreading sure the word does, to yeah. Hoosiers. It's all good for the American farmers and Indiana farmers. Homegrown <laughs> energy. It That's just right. takes us one step toward helping our country reduce the dependence yeah. of foreign oil. One of Becky Skillman's major successes as Lieutenant Governor dealt with Crane Naval Base. Like all Hoosiers, Becky takes great pride in Indiana's military tradition. We were really up against it in Indiana on this base closing and realignment. Um, all signs pointed to the fact that uh, we would lose this very important base in this very important uh, part of Indiana where we needed the employment. 5,500 jobs were at stake. Uh, Becky uh, tore into this thing, uh, just really took charge. She was the team leader. She pulled people together. We were down in St. Louis when uh, uh, all the other seven states had their people in. Becky stood toe-to-toe -to -toe with them, uh, prevailed, and ultimately Indiana was successful, not only in retaining the base and retaining the 5,500 jobs, but also now adding 1,000 new jobs to that. So that's a great success story, one of many of Becky's uh, achievements Together with the governor, I think they've been just a terrific team in leading Indiana. A lot of Fortune 500 contractors that do work for Crane and see now um, logic in actually locating their operations here in Indiana. Uh, so I think there's great potential for growth in the defense industry. She has brought a great deal of integrity and character learned a lot of skills, and I think is a very, very effective lieutenant uh, governor. And I'm really proud of having someone like this uh, lead us in Indiana because I think the kind of person she is truly reflects Hoosier values, and I think Hoosiers are proud of her, and I certainly am.